Good morning, Morning Tide Sons, and welcome to another marvelous Monday here at Morning Elementary. We hope that everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving break and is ready to get back to work because there's a lot of work to do because we only have a few weeks before we go on Christmas break. Okay, we hope that everybody stayed safe and practice social distancing and wore their mask if they went out in public. And so, of course, we welcome the new students who are here at campus now. We have a lot more students today, and so we hope that they are having a great day today. Today, we'll be having an SVDM meeting at 3.30. Finally, uh, we've been scheduling and rescheduled that meeting, but today we'll be having an SVDM meeting at 3.30. We'd like to congratulate our employees of the week, Ms. Maria Cruz, Ms. Maria Elena Gutierrez, Mr. Agustin Serna, and Ms. Sofia Ramirez, one of our cafeteria staff members. Congratulations to you all for being our employees of the week. Right now we have Ms. Casares here with a few tidbits of information. Good morning, Morningside Sons. Hope everybody's doing well this morning. It was nice to see all the faces here at school and I'm sure that all of you at home are also doing well. Um, this morning I have some useless tidbits of information for you. Some of the people born on this day are novelist Mark Twain in 1835. Dick Clark, host of American Bandstand, was born in 1929 actor Mandy Patinkin in 1952 and actor Ben Stiller was born on this day in 1965. It was on this day in 1993 that B President Bill Clinton signed the gun control Bra Brady Bill into law. On this day in 1838, Mexico declared war on France. Non-belief in Nazism is proclaimed grounds for divorce in Germany in 1935. In 1803, on this day, Spain ceded her claims to the Louisiana Territory. I don't see any birthdays listed on my sheet this uh, morning, but if you are celebrating a, a birthday, we want to wish you a very happy birthday. We hope that you have a very special day today. And just a reminder to all our boys and girls, if you're here at school, don't forget you need to be wearing your mask at all times. Make sure it's covering your nose and chin, that you're covering all your face. And don't forget that you need to be washing your hands frequently as well. I hope everybody had a great holiday. Have a great day, boys and girls. Have a good one. And remember, boys and girls, that every day and in every way, we're getting better and better and better. I almost forgot. Bye. And now we have Mr. Cruchel here with a few words of wisdom. Good morning, Morningside Sons. This is Mr. Cruchel with a few words of wisdom. When great American actress Cicely Tyson was a child, her mother taught her and her brother and sister to embroider. They would sit for hours, stitching beautiful patterns onto huge things like tablecloths and bedspreads. Each one would work on a separate corner, and although they worked separately, they were always connected by this huge piece of fabric. When their work was done, they had created one big, beautiful work of art. Each one of us has something unique to contribute to this huge thing we call the quilt of life. We can contribute regardless of our age or the color of our skin or the religion we practice or the size of our home. When each one of us contributes to our own small piece of the quilt, we create something good and beautiful in our schools in our communities, and in the whole world. With somebody to think about, this is Mr. Grishel. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. And yes, students, the choice is always yours. Once again, we would like to welcome the new students who came in for the first time today. Uh, we ask that everybody, faculty, staff, students, follow the safety protocols, that you wear your face mask at all time, that you practice social distancing, that you wash your hands frequently, and use hand sanitizer, okay, so that everybody will stay safe. Okay, I believe that those are all the announcements. Have a super great day and a super great week, and remember that Morningside Suns always shine the brightest.